Hello, my lovely Leo. How are you, loves? I hope everybody's well. Leo, welcome to this daily special. And we'll do a reading for the dailies of the 24th and the 25th of December. For all of you who do celebrate Christmas or just resting, have a blessed day. And let's see here, loves, what we have for you and how these energies are floating and brings to you and what brings to you loves sun moon rising signs and venus science leos take what mostly resonates leave what doesn't even it's a daily energy daily reading might be bigger than just a daily reading let's see loves what we have here time to go and underneath we have let your past go this card I pick up for Aries but indeed here there is something here that as the Spirit says what you cannot control let it go time to go from the daily guidance angels the Sun sets and rises each day and is the same with the avenues in your life. See the beauty within each sunset in your life and know that the sun will also rise again tomorrow. Endings are merely the start of a new beginning. And we are with you through each phrase and cycle. Whatever ends, Something else starts loves. Let go our situation here because there is blessings coming to you. Our right, loves. Releasing something is bringing you something better. You know that. But let's hear what the Spirit want to share with you since this day we've been requested and thank you for all of you who did send the emails and requested this. Also, very much thankful for all of you coming in here and sharing your energy and in tuning with this energy. Leo, Sun, Moon, Rising Science and Venus Science daily special. We have Seven of Pentacles. There's something here you indeed put a lot of effort in. Probably with a water sign. Been waiting for the results to come in. But seems that is not quite what you expected. So if you waited something here to come forward to you, Spirit says, let it go. Whatever it is here, with this Five of Swords, it's kind of the wait it's over. Because Spirit says their abundance, you are waiting from whoever is not there. It's somewhere else. Five of Pentacles, Ten of Wands, Four of Cups, Ace of Swords, Six of Pentacles, Eight of Pentacles, Knight of Pentacles, Seven of Swords, and the King of Cups. Indeed here there is, there is something here that some of you might say, well, this cost me so much. Could cost you money, could cost you time. King of Cups, Queen of Cups. Something here that is not quite you expe expected or wanted. And Spirit says, there is something new coming in for you. Or it's already here. But you got to see it clearly. Because yes, somebody here might left you out in a cold. And it was the person you wanted strongly. But for you to have balance is to see clearly 
and not lie to yourself that there is a new beginning. And indeed it is. But also, giving a chance to somebody is because you really believe that somebody deserve it. Not because you want somebody to make jealous or to show the other person that you can have somebody else. Keep in mind that, loves. Because whatever is here, Spirit says, don't feel that you are stuck because you are not. Because being stuck and refusing to move forward it's something else. There are two different things. Because we have five, six, seven. Eight of Pentacles got to be next. And that very much speaks about working on the things which are tangible to you, which are good to you, which are fulfilling you. Focusing on the real energy not the unreal but let's see here six of pentacles what that speaks to you it's like you i'm looking for stability what's that for me nine of pentacles eight of pentacles here you are and the Hierophant and underneath we have the Judgment card which that very much speaks about do you feel this awakening or not an aha moment it's coming or it's already here in the place to tell you that whatever you don't feel stable the work you need to be doing it's on you but look at here, it's like, I want to do it, but they are back to back. When I will see them ju just this way, it's like, yes, I will focus and I will do the work on myself. So there is need of a balance here. The balance who will provide you that stability you are asking from the universe. And the thing here is... You can do it. You absolutely can do it on your own. Don't lie to yourself. Don't feel like, well, you know, you know that victim mentality. N nothing works. Like I have a friend which always told me, well, every time when I try to build something, never works. Never is inter Nobody is interested in things like that. But the thing is, if you want results, you gotta be consistent. If you want results, you need to have, be patient. You need to be patient. You need to work hard for that. And as well, movement slow will provide that. Because stability here, you can have. The universe is telling you, learn from the past. But you can do it. Don't feel like, well, I will wait. I'll have the expectations. Don't do that to yourself. The thing is, is not that you don't see it or you can't do it. Because you can. It's too wanting to do it. Let's see here, Knight of Pentacles, why you are here. Three of Cups. Three of Wands. Empress. And Queen of Swords. There is here somebody could be a mother figure, could be somebody as a third party here, a good friend. But this friend is telling you straightforward. 
what is all about it's kind of this person is telling you hey whatever you do right now whoever is this person around you they are not honest and for you to progress whatever you need to you need to do it on your own you have a very good friend could be for some of you there is your it is a mother figure there is a libra or a taurus here could be um, a virgo as well but that person sees clearly and it's kind of like i don't see the way you see i see it through my eyes i see from the distance what is going on what you've gone through don't lie to yourself And you, Leo, it's kind of like, well, I'm not sure. But I feel here you will in a very short time. It's like whatever movement here needs to happen, you might resist it. You might not believe in yourself. You might resist like the to the to the truth. You might resist to like there is a person here clearly is telling you things. And you might feel like they they are the one who is against you, but actually this person is for you. They are trying to help you and to move forward. And also is th this person is the one who believes in you that you can do things, that you can change so many things here. Just don't resist it. It's also, it's kind of learn what you need to do and move forward. Because what I'm feeling here, this King of Cups energy here, it's you loves. King of Wands. It's you, Leo. Don't resist this person because this person is the one who, who is there for you. And they might be a little like too harsh when they talk to you, but they want to understand that they are honest. Yes, Queen of Swords is that queen who doesn't really have a filter whatever they say they will tell you straightforward exactly as they see it and they are could be a very good friend could be your mother could be that third party we're talking about here but it's like this person sees how you are and who you truly needs to be they see it and whatever situation here you've been dealing here, not balanced, not satisfying, they might tell you, don't lie to yourself. There gotta be a change. Don't resist this change. And learn from it. Because you can be stable and balanced. But there is something here you need to put effort into. So whatever is here, it's time to let it go. Because the blessings are about to come. Also, Spirit says there is something here. Like an opportunity to forgive whatever it was and whatever you've been gone through. One advice for the Leos. Wow. Knight of Cups. Emperor. And the Tower. Full. And two of ones, tic-tac loves, make a decision at the crossroads energy here. The blessing are come one after another one. And spirit says here that you need to stay in your power 
to see it, whatever is there. Because it's kind of like the things come like when it's raining, it's pouring the energy, you know. But the new beginning, it's coming in here. Also, for some of you, for some of you, you are leaving somebody for somebody else. But I feel here, who you are leaving, they're quite dishonest. They're quite manipulative. And who you are moving towards... It is somebody who might come as a friend, but I feel here that person could be even more. As we have here the Empress and the Emperor, that person might be as a partner for the future. But I feel here this person cares very much for you. Very much. There's no doubt. And here he is, loves. There's a new beginning. There's a new beginning. Love and light and happy holidays, blessings. And of course, Leo will see you next time. Namaste.